have a BMW F30 with a leaky door, it's usually the vapor barrier in the door. Super easy to fix. Don't have to spend a fortune at the dealer. Telltale sign is water up here, then it runs down inside. And you have to keep a towel here because your floorboards get soaking wet. So if you have water up here, it's usually your vapor barrier. Easy to tell. Go underneath here. Bottom of your door. Grab my light. There we go. Sorry about that. I've already popped the bottom of the door off. You just stick your fingers in and give it a yank. These clips will just pop off. No big deal. Sometimes they break. Most of the time they, they don't. The vehicle's new enough. Jam a 2x4 in there to hold the door open for you. The panel, that is. And up inside of here. There we go. If I can get that in there. There we go. You'll find your defective vapor barrier. And there it is. If it comes off like that, there's your leak. And mine's leaking bad. It should be glued up against here, but it's not. BMW uses butyl tape and it falls off just after a couple of years. There isn't even any residue on here. Butyl tape's still on the door, sticky on the door, but not on the uh, vapor barrier here. Known issue, but they won't fix it. They won't recall it. Just keep, keep fixing it. So here's your fix. Get yourself some black RTV silicone. Clean that area first, make sure there's no mud or dirt up in there. Squirt yourself a whole crap load of it on the vapor barrier. Pretend like I just did. And you'll squish it back up against the seal where it usually sits. Wait about a half an hour or so for it to dry. Make sure it's still stuck real good. Give it a little tug, see if it comes off. Of course, there's none on there yet. And uh, you should be good. Yeah, that's it. You don't have to tear the whole freaking door panel off. Just pop the clips, go in through the bottom, find your leak, and fix it. It's always leaking out the bottom usually. And that's where it pours in through the vehicle. Tried to make this one quick and easy without ripping the whole freaking door off like everyone else does. It's always leaking at the bottom, so you can just go in through the bottom, put silicone, good to go. All right, hope this is useful to you guys.